this is Helmut Norpert. He is a professor who has made a couple of very good projections on who wins the presidency of the United States. His theory are a bit different from the one of this guy, Alan Lichtman, which of course I've also made a few videos about. Now, Dr. Northput's uh, theories has take into account the importance of primaries, and the other theory he uses takes into account the importance of the swing of the pendulum. More about that now. So it's right now the man who can add another winning prediction to his record, uh, political science professor from Stony Brook University, Helmut Norpoth. Do you believe your prediction enough to put your money in a legal way in a betting market behind your prediction? Yes, I have. I've, uh, I've uh, gone all in in the Iowa market, which is sort of the oldest prediction market where it's legal to do that. Well, there are two things. Okay, the model is called the primary model, so I take into account primary elections, real elections, how the candidates are performing, and uh, I can track primaries for about a hundred years since 1912 so it's quite a quite a set of elections yes when you were with us in february people thought you were crazy this was a change election and over 200 years of elections if you if you chart them you see that said the definite swing of the pendulum and this was a year in which the pendulum was swinging back from the party in the white house to the other party so let's now take a look at how his predictions have been in uh, this cycle what is he expecting for the year of 2020 between Joe Biden and Donald Trump? And he has actually already made his prediction, though it might be a bit too early since we have this uh, whole situation with race riots. So the professor gives it a 95 to 91, 91 to 95% certainty that Trump will be re-elected. Now, this one, he has actually... He started with this in 1996, I think that 2000 was the one that was very hard to predict. In the possible matchup here with Bernie Sanders, which of course is not going to happen, Trump's chance of winning would be 95% and get probably 390 electoral votes. And if it was against Biden, he has a 91% chance that would get 362% of the votes according to this theory. So it is really interesting. Of course, this puts Trump as the absolute favorite based on the primary prediction. And of course, the swing of the pendulum is still favoring the Republicans this year, because we've only had them for four years. If we had had Republicans for eight years, the country would be more uh, acceptable or wanting of a Democrat. But that's not exactly the case right now. So, so this absolutely favors Trump tremendously. And though recent events, not necessarily the pandemic, but uh, the riots might be a problem for Trump because of social unrest and social unrest is bad for the incumbent. It clearly takes a lot to turn this one around. And this guy is a guy who has a record of project predicting correctly. Anyway, that's it from me today. Please like this video. Please subscribe. Have a good day.